Cheryl is asking, what are your thoughts and possible solutions in relation to the issue of individuals who, after undergoing alcohol or drug rehabilitation, end up returning to the same environment with no support or follow-up? And if we can get granular on that as well, if you know of any specific follow-up services that are easily accessible, um, even, even if it's remote or virtual, then please let us know. Yeah, okay. So um, I think um, this is a big problem. Um, people go into treatment. Um, it's probably why the relapse rate from um, the treatment is as high as it is, even though it's similar for other chronic diseases um, or disorders. There, uh, um, uh, if you, yeah, if you go um, to treatment and you might be doing quite well, and then you go back into an environment where your drug use is being reinforced um, again, or you're um, exposed to it before you're ready, then um, yeah, the, the likelihood is that that relapse will occur. So most services now are providing um, aftercare programs of some sort. So there's that. Um, you could uh, refer someone into treatment uh, so counselling treatment, for example, and they could have some kind of light follow up. Um, but there's a whole range of peer support programs now. So if someone, as I said earlier, if someone is interested in AA and that philosophy, there's there the benefit of AA and NA are that they're everywhere. So you will be able to find a group to go to um, that is five minutes walk from wherever you are, because there's just there are just so many of them, and now they're also online. Uh, and the other um, the other place um, which Pedro you mentioned I was on the board of is Hello Sunday Morning, and there that is a um, a big online community. You can just drop in and out of it. Um, you sign up. There's resources in there. You can chat with people. So it's a kind of peer support um, network that you can build around yourself. Um, but I always also encourage people. Um, once, you know, with a formal part of treatment um, finished is to just, um, you know, like check in every couple of months, even by email or give your clients a call just to see how they're going, because it might mean the difference between them relapsing and then being able to say, gee, I've been really craving a lot lately. Maybe I should come in, just have one more, you know, a top up session with you.